look comfortable playing in. Yeah, it's funny because when you look at Nor Roma, Montes and Vasquez both in that. They've got uh, a reasonable amount of height in this Mexican team. Montes, the player that we've seen, stands close to two metres tall. I mean, he really... To, uh, to just to give it to him comfortably. Mexico offering plenty of width. You can see the movement of Rodriguez over on the right-hand side. Midfield in acres of... It's a nicely flighted ball that. Gignac underneath it as well. And uh, so too was Nat waiting in the centre. Plenty of Mexican defenders back. Nicked away that time by Lefe. And looking on the edge of the penalty area, Martin went inside the penalty area once again. Stem still there with his arms raised. Rodriguez also on support inside the penalty area. Norden is in there, so too is Gignac. 50-50 yeah. ball, I agree. Today. Is hurt, I think. Rodriguez. It's going to be Vega to swing this out. As that's a lovely ball. There's the cut inside, and Vega cleared off the line by Sanye and Michelin. Let off his drop a shoulder and dart through. Brilliant bit of play this by Lanez. There's the tee up for Martin. Very nearly went all the way on his own. Fantastic forward again. 11 here is Vega. Got the shot off of the whistle had already gone. front of their, their centre forward and cause problems and and that's why I think Mexico is waiting for Sanchez to go out on the overlap two waiting inside the penalty area here oh that's beautifully done but maybe Michelin make his way forward is Gignac and again makes even the simple look like it's an extraordinary <laughs> moment does the uh, Gignac to try and bend it in here France got plenty of ball this is Nunan Gets a good shot in, and that is again good piece of keeping by Akoa. Cordova by Pasquale made a lot of that, didn't he? Penalised there is Vega. Yeah, it's just drifted into their 18 yard line. And that finishing teams off is often a problem, uh, and goals being scored often a problem. There's Michelin. Sanchez Martin is in there. This is Vega. Vega feeding it to Cordova. And he's pulled it wide. But it is the speed and the precision at which they attack, which Ovan Michelin on the overlap. Can he dig out a decent cross? And drill right across the six yard area. Nobody there to apply a finishing touch. Nice from Romo. You know he's always going to come inside on his left, left on his left foot. And the... Lanez, Lanez still in there. Goes back up there. Lanez in there, swings wildly at it and misses it. Got a threat with Guinea always when they go forward. So Rodriguez, well that's an absolutely magnificent ball in there by Rodriguez and Cordoba. I think he might well have been offside. They don't want to let him in the penalty area, but they have. Lanez then in, and what a goal that is. Vega directed the header beautifully past Bernardoni, but Lanez served it up to him on a plate. And it's uh, Sanya Martin is around him. There's Vega again. That is a good, good piece of goalkeeping. How on earth was in there? Here is Vega. Oh, he got right underneath it. Do that. It's a way good control by Nudan might have a go here himself, but distance was against him and he got. And is it onside again? Cordova's in, and Cordova produces a very good finish indeed. Yeah. Yeah, great finish by Cordova. There's a. Oh, Cordova is in again behind. Can he get the cross in? He can. He's trying to make these little runs, nobody is seeing him. Vasquez, it's a good bit of play that by Vasquez. Uh, Vega mirrored what Savigny was doing. Lafay leaving it. And that was not too far away in the end. With Thurbat seeing it up on the edge of the penalty area. There's got a Moane. Uh, Lafay should be easy. That was Laneth. Aguirre. 
Oh, got him one ears away here, he's on his own. What can he do? Oh, that's got to be a penalty. Absolute stonewall penalty. Montez taking his man down. Not even. Oh, finally, we're ready. Gignac kick can he find the back of the net? He does. I'll go, I guess, right, and he's frustrated that he didn't save it. But all that matters is that France are very much back in the game. The pace is big. I'm afraid to take players on and then sets it up at the back post. Looking for Thurbat. Yes, Lefay has nicked it away again. Lefay was half a shot. But a dig in deep again was Sanchez, the Republic of Korea 1 1, the Cote d'Ivoire. And for others to get up there and join him and looking for an angle on the edge of the penalty area. There's plenty of. He can do it on his own. This is Antuna. Which way is he going to go? And he pulls it just wide. He's close. Third with each other, that's the thing, in the, at half time. There's Michelin. And it wasn't going to drop anywhere or anytime soon. Another Mexican. Little gap to make the cross. Antuna onto his left foot here. Antuna, oh, that is brilliantly done by Antuna. The gap was so tight, but he managed to thread it through, and he's given them a real degree of comfort now as we enter the final stages of this game. Mexico lead. Absolutely and totally agree with you, but as soon as that second half started... Looking for the return, Sanchez with the cutback this... But immediately into the action and gives the ball away. Oh, what a finish that was. He's only been on the field a matter of a minute and Aguirre has just rifled that pass to Bernardoni who had absolutely no chance whatsoever of stopping.